I may be wrong here, but some statistics that were given to me some time back actually stated that uh, 3.2 billion people watch Hollywood and 3.8 billion watch Indian cinema. So, in some ways, we are ahead of them, and I hope we can uh, continue to be that way. So, I feel that um, uh, why imitate somebody else? And uh, I'm sorry for bringing this up, but you know, when you see my film Shamitab, you will find incidents of this as well in the film. Thank okay. you. Okay. We're looking forward, of course, to watching that film. And Rohit, one of the things you've written about in the book is covering the hospital beat uh, or, or what journalists describe as, as that job when you're meant to report live coverage when celebrities are admitted in hospital. You've written about covering, um, you know, reporting from Leelavati Hospital when Mr. Bachchan was at a health scare a few years ago. You've spoken about how journalists bond at such occasions. They bond over lunch at a nearby restaurant. The question I, I have to ask you is, you know, do you find that as journalists we tend to become desensitized towards film stars? We, we tend to see them just as stories and not as human beings and people who face challenges and, and, and you know, health scares? We are the most insensitive people on earth. So, we are, no doubt about that. So, uh, sorry I'm bringing this up, but yeah, when, when celebrities are at the hospital, small example, um, if Sir is in the hospital and we see Abhishek going inside, wonder why he didn't speak to us. We don't realize that it's his father inside. We just feel, oh, he didn't speak to us. A lot of, lot of media members, we do feel, but yeah, we are very insensitive. We should change that. We should bond at better places and not outside hospitals. Um, I just feel that it's a very sensitive moment when someone is ill. Um, whereas I should respect the right of the journalist uh, in the freedom of expression that he has, and I respect that. But uh, sometimes the sensitivity of the moment and the emotions that run with the people that are involved uh, needs to be understood. There have been many occasions, unfortunately, when I've had to be in hospital. And uh, what happens at times is that it has taken almost 20 minutes for me to come out of the ambulance and be taken to the ICU, uh, purely because uh, the gates of the ambulance could not open because the photographers and the journalists were actually blocking it. And uh, if there are emotions expressed by members of the family at that point of time, that needs to be understood a bit. But um, we had another, I had another surprising incident when I was in, on another occasion in the hospital. Um, when I was in the ICU, um, after a couple of days, uh, Jaya, who had also taken a room in the hospital for the family to live in, uh, suddenly walked down one morning and said, uh, why are you giving interviews from the ICU? So I said, no, I'm not doing any interviews. He said, no, but you know, the, the whole media is uh, writing what you're wearing, what you're doing, what you were saying. I said, I haven't done anything of the sort. It was actually a very enterprising journalist who dressed up as a doctor put a stethoscope around their neck, walked into the ICU, came and said hello to me, and I responded and said hello, and she said, how are you feeling? I said, I'm fine. I said, are you a doctor? She said, yes. And that's it. And she went and reported outside. Sometimes it's a little intrusive, but uh, also uh, it doesn't speak very well for the security of the hospital. But um, uh, yeah, I would look upon it as, uh, as you know, lightheartedness. The, the management of the, of the media company that sent her in was actually quite proud of her. So, you know, I really appreciate the fact that you had the guts to go in there. But, you know, these are some of the things that happened. But most of the times, I think the, the media has been very sensitive towards such occasions. Mr. Patel, this is a book about the life and times of a film journalist. It talks about the various experiences of meeting with actors and, and, and covering the beat of journalism. Do you remember, you've been an actor for so many years now, do you remember, is it fair to ask you to jog your memory and ask you if you remember the first interview that you gave? Do you have any memory of that? To whom, when? Uh, yes, I do. Um, I did a few interviews before actually joining films, uh, but that's best forgotten. Um, when, I, when I came to the movies, I think um, the first interview I did was, was with um, Davy, 
from uh, Stern Style. Devyani Chopal. Devyani Chopal, yes. Ruth, Hindi film stars have their own standard time. I'm a little embarrassed to say this in front of Mr. Bachchan because he, of course, has a reputation for being extremely punctual, punctual to a fault, in fact. But, you know, as journalists, 